The bed was the bed was too kind to me this morning. Oh. He's been here since half past seven. Have you? <laughs> you said you'd be here early, so I'm an early bird, me, you know what I mean? I'll come at half seven tomorrow, you want me to? Oh, well, this is it, you see. I'll make him an easy one. <laughs> <laughs> Just to spite you. Just go like that. <laughs> I'll watch over there and look at him. I've got to open the door for you. Let the builders in. This morning the bed was too nice to me. Oh. Can you lift this up? There's a tape behind there. He's left us he's left us tape behind uh, the wall. He told me yesterday. It's fucking hard woman, yeah. Black and white. Must have been left to keep it keep it in the Can you get that plaster ball by there? Um uh, I've got plaster balls from more moisture balls. So is it? <laughs> So got in, builders downstairs doing the work and had my uh, porridge here because I was too late getting up uh, for the builders this morning. Um, just watching a bit of Gary V while I wake up and catch up on some emails and some messages from clients. And today um, what I want to do is something quite quirky. I want to give away our um, Empowered by Eating recipe book. Um, so this is going to be ongoing, so whenever you watch this in the future, you can get, basically win the, the recipe book. So basically, um, the, the recipe book has seven days of food, seven days of recipes, all the calories, all the macros, and it's suited to body weight of the person. Because you know on the internet, they're all like, generic meal plans which are pretty crap. I have to excuse the building work behind me. So, <clears throat> what I'm going to do, is there's going to be a post-it note somewhere saying free recipe seven day free recipe book right it's going to be stuck somewhere tomorrow or the next vlog so the, the one after this one so what you're gonna to have to do is have a look and tell me the time where I'm talking and it's stuck so it might just be on the screen like that it might say free recipe meal book what you have to do is tell me what time it was stuck on the board or wherever it was stuck and I'll send them this recipe, put it in the comments below and I'll send over the free recipe meal book for you and hope it will help you a little bit get to your nutrition goals. great to see Chris working on the radiators and if we just go back in time to quite a while ago when we had him come and quote you can see us like chatting about what we were actually going to do it's nice to actually see the physical work actually happening two showers there and maybe a radiator then yeah so radiator possibly on on the wall there or it's so, here so whatever's easy for you yeah okay yeah you have to faff around going around the room do you to get to there it's, it's just it's just a seat. case of coming through the ceiling yeah yeah and finding because what's above us here uh, that open loft I knocked out. And we so this is this is going out, isn't it? Yeah. So we could do a hot water on that tap there. Hot, yeah, hot water. Yeah, yeah. I'll get onto the hot water. For that. Uh, this will be knocked out. Yeah. It'll have the disabled. So this, this is going to stay. We're going to leave this as it is. Yeah. Imagine yeah. The mirror yeah. As well. yeah. I'd leave that all there like that. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you just run a pipe and put it in the wall, do you? And that's pretty much it. Two pipes. Two pipes will run right the way along. Okay. And then what it'll be is the radiators will sit on. On here. Cool. Oh, you finished. Can you do it again? One more. Can you do it again for the camera? Come on in. <laughs> just for the camera, just for you. Ooh. 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 You only got me then. I meant to. Like you know what you're doing there, Chris. I know. <laughs> nice to meet you have a nice drive down. Yeah, yeah, good, good. good. A little bit delayed. That's really. Road work. Right. So yeah, we want to we want to basically use the marketing van as like 
we we use a lot of social media stuff, uh -huh. but we also want to be able to drive around with the yeah, van, yeah. and it's going to help the, uh, the business. help the business and things yeah. like that. Well, you got a camera in there with us. <laughs> that's what I got. That's what I got a hey, camera to look after. Make sure you're uh, like that, make sure you're looking after Paul. <laughs> Oh, it's a fast one. Builders, builders, builders. How's that different going on, all right? Snags. Snags. Problems. That's exactly how I think. Can I smash that window? What window? You'll have to wait until the brick lights on. Well, you make sure I get me tea. You can, you can smash the window. Why can't you smash the window? You could if you want if you need it. We can lend you a tape. You just guess, don't you, when you measure? You do like that. So it's pretty late in the evening now, everyone's gone. Just want to go and take it and show you what's going on with the showers. So you remember this sh shitty room that was really minging a couple of days ago? Ta da! We have showers. Oh yes. Fear sitting there bored waiting for me to finish. Feed logging. That's the other room. This is the female changing. Proper nice enclosed toilet border. Showers done. Looks good. Let's go home. Dirty through the darkness. It's in the reception. There's going to be cabinets on the back, cabinets in the front, and then the worktop goes on top. So today was actually quite a stressful day. There was a lot of stuff that I had to do. Um, it took quite a lot of mental effort to get it done, I should say. Um, as you can see, the bathrooms are looking good. Uh, well, the changing rooms and showers are looking good. strategies coming together we are on target there's a few things that are behind time um, so we're going to be working on them over the next few days uh, to catch up tomorrow morning we're off to get all of the paints for the unit we're going to be graffitiing uh, inside i'm going to time lapse that i might throw a few time i, I might throw a few time lapses in this video as well so you can see the uh, building work being done all be tidied up, bathroom is painted, we're going to get that paint. Um, we can go in the bathrooms, uh, changing room, there's no bath in there. Anyway, so we're going to be um, painting, the, painting the right colours, graffiti in, it's one of our big jobs tomorrow. Um, just got flash tags and nobody lights on. So exercise wise and training wise, it was my day off uh, at the gym today. I wanted to get some cardio done, um, but I just literally didn't have a second today. I'm gonna have to catch up tomorrow. Obviously, a lot of time is being taken up doing this. It's now 8 p.m. and I got to the gym to be at 8 a.m. and left for half an hour for lunch because I had to go and get dinner from my house. And that's it, I had two meals today, breakfast and lunch. Um, but of course, as long as my macros are hit at the end of the day and I've had at least two or three meals, I'm still on track, I'm still on goal for my fitness journey. So, that is the end of the day and 
hope to see you guys tomorrow and soon this vlog will turn into a bit of training inside the new gym but thanks for watching so don't forget tomorrow we're going to be posting the post-it note somewhere with a free recipe meal book it took about i don't know three uh three or four months to write and it's got every single meal in there defined to your body type so there's actually five meal plans uh well, sorry meal plans actually five meal uh, recipe books seven days food all the macros are in there all the calories are in there an explanation of how to make that help you and your goals just a little bit of inspiration to help you out I want to be able to give that to people who comment the right time when the post-it note was hidden within the vlog. Uh, just a bit, bit of fun and a bit of interaction. And today what happened was a lot of people, it was a very, very nice post. Um, a shout out to Clifton. Um, he did a very nice post today talking about one of the vlogs from last week when I was talking about not breaking down the... the uh, building the biggest building but not breaking down the other buildings while you're building the biggest building and what it meant was is I don't want to break anybody else within the fitness industry I want to help everybody else I want to enhance their fitness business their fitness businesses and their gyms and their their journey and their PT journey because it's a 60 billion pound this is 60 billion pound industry there's so much that we can the, the fitness people can take in terms of money of course but if you base it around helping people the money will come and that's what we're doing that's what we've done for the past um, five six seven years that's what I've personally done and that's what makes me happy and that's what makes people <laughs> more empowered um, excuse the pun so yeah that's the end of the day and don't forget to look out for that and I'd love some interaction whatever you think about these vlogs whether it be good, whether it be bad, comment below, whether you're on YouTube or Facebook. Let me know what your thoughts are. You know, I, I see your numbers, I see the same people sharing them, thank you very much. I see the same likes, which is awesome. I just want to know a little bit of uh, about what you think, whether it be now or whenever you're watching this in the future, still comment.